want to welcome you to the Ask Jeff YouTube channel. Here's today's question. Does God intentionally harden people's hearts and cause them not to understand him? Referencing Luke chapter 8, verse 10. Now, there are multiple places, not only in the Gospel of Luke, but also in the book of Exodus, where it says that God hardens somebody's heart. Essentially makes it to the point where they are unable or incapable of rendering a decision for him. Now, let's qualify this in two ways. Go back to the famous story about Pharaoh, where God says, I have hardened his heart. There's this thing in the Old Testament that we call the prophetic perfect. What that means is that God speaks of the future as if it's already in the past because obviously he is outside and the author of time. But when you look at the famous 10 plagues, the first five plagues, it says Pharaoh hardened his heart. And on the sixth plague, it says that God hardened his heart. This is an important qualifier because we do have pictures where God hardens somebody's heart, but it is after he's given them the opportunity to willingly respond to the direction of their life from him. So what does that have to do with the Gospel of Luke chapter 8? Well, in Romans chapter 1, it talks about those who've turned the invisible creator into tangible, creeping things, images and such, that God gives them over to a reprobate mind. What does that mean? Basically, God allows us to, quote, go down that road if we so desire. And at the end of that road is a hardened heart by God. So, yes, God does harden hearts, but not without the opportunity for one to turn their heart toward him. Great question. If you have one, send it to askjeff.net. Maybe your question will be tomorrow's. Thanks for being a part of today's daily question. Now, we answer a question each and every day. Please feel free to submit a new question at askjeff.net. We may not have gotten to yours today, but we eventually will continue to be a part of this. Subscribe so you don't miss out on a question every day.